We are going to make a 3D pop-up card about today's memory verse. Let's start at the very beginning, Genesis 1 verse 1. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Our craft is a part of the creation series based on the first chapter of the book of Genesis. What we need to prepare first are the printouts. Download link in the description below. Two art papers, preferably black or blue. But if you don't have them, just choose a color you like. Take your markers out or any coloring material you have. Pencil, ruler, scissors, and glue. And if you have any metallic pens, take them out too. If you don't have a printer, that's okay. Just prepare your bottle cap and bond paper. We have our printouts ready. There's a colored version available if you want to use that. If not, just use it as a guide. If you don't have a printer, just pause the screen and copy the drawing on your bond paper with your pencil. Use the bottle cap to make perfect circles. We have all our planets and some galaxies, the stars, the sun, and the moon. God created them all. The earth is just a tiny part of God's creation. There are still so much more that we haven't discovered yet. But one thing is for sure. Everything was created by the Lord. Take one of your art paper and we'll fold it in half. Get your ruler and pencil. We'll measure 2 inches from the bottom and make a mark. Make sure that you're measuring on the folded end. From there, we'll mark another 1 and a half inches. From these two marks, we'll make two horizontal lines of 2 and a half inches. We'll also make one fourth inch border around it that we'll cut later. As you can see, my black paper is already smaller than the blue one, so we'll leave it at that. Pick your other art paper and fold it in half as well. Prepare your scissors. Always remember to be careful and don't be shy to ask an adult for help. First, Let's take the art paper and we'll cut the horizontal lines. When we open it up, it'll look something like this. Then we'll fold it inward, creating a small box. I enjoy cutting cutouts like this, but it gets a bit challenging when there are so many elements and some of them are really small. You just have to take a deep breath and be patient. Even during this activity, 
God is developing us, especially our patience. As I cut this, I meditate on God's goodness and blessings. I even prayed while I snipped away with my scissors. We're almost done. Just hang in there. Gather the cutouts and let's determine where we are going to put them. Let's look at our memory verse first. The words in the beginning will be placed outside of the card. So let's get the other art paper and glue it in front. After that, we'll glue the two art papers together like so. One half first, and then the other. Make sure that both paper are snugly connected at the center fold. Let's get the rest of our verses. God created the heavens and the earth. Genesis 1.1 1, 1. You can put God on top, or anywhere you want it to be. I'll put mine over here. Just have to make sure that the verses can still be read in order. And the word created? Hmm, somewhere here. Since we'll be putting some of the planets in the box, we can also place the word the heavens with them. But first, let's place our sun. We'll stick our planets on top of the other like this, so they pop up when we open it. If you want, you can also put the earth inside the box. But I will put mine here, outside, together with the word, the earth. Lastly, at the bottom, in the right corner, we can place Genesis 1 verse 1. Put the rest of the cutouts wherever you like and when you're satisfied, you can glue them right in. Use all the elements or just some of it. However, I think it really looks better when we place all of them in our card. We're finished, but if you have any metallic pen or markers, we can use them to add more sparkle to our pop-up. Add some small details to the inside or the outside of the card as well. But if you prefer plain, that's great too. It seems like our planets won't stay up. We can find a piece of cardboard and glue it at the back. Wait for the glue to dry. See, it's holding up now. I'm going to create another pop-up card with a colored version. Remember the measurements from before? Now that we have the same size paper, I'll be putting a 1 4 inch border around it. This is to make sure that the inner one is smaller than the outer one.
We already know that our planets need help to stay up. I decided to place them in a cardboard first. If you have a thicker paper, like the ones they use for business cards, you can use that to print out your planets and other elements. It holds up better this time. Hmm, I see that the front part of the planet still needs some extra help. Let's put a scotch tape in front. And yes, it's standing up well. Now we have our pop-up card about the first verse in the Bible, which is also about the beginning of the heavens and the earth. This is just the introduction craft for the creation series. Join us on more projects that focus on each day of the creation. Thanks for crafting with us today, and keep on being creative, and see you again next time.